The slow day, the common, the night will unfold. I met Courtney and Jomar when we were both in middle school. So we've seen each other through all of our awkward, gawky phases. And thank God those are mostly over with, right? Courtney has been the best friend to me for so long. She is the kindest, most caring person. She is always supportive the best dance partner around from middle school dances when it wasn't cool to dance with boys, right? You dance with each other. Um, I met Jomar when he was like the cool, mysterious noob kid who transferred to our middle school in seventh grade. The story of Courtney and Jomar has been such a long time in the making. They were friends for the longest time all throughout high school, middle school, and when Court went to South Dakota for college, they stayed in constant touch. But Jomar was playing the long game. And that's why I know today that they are meant to be. Courtney and Jomar, I've seen you both grow up in so many ways over all of the years. And I've seen you guys grow as a couple too. May you both grow together in life and love. My brother has always been my idol. Um, He's someone that I nonstop looked up to for my entire life. Um, well, until I grew up tall, uh, grew taller than him, but uh, <laughs> uh, but he's he's taught me um, you know a lot of how to be bold, uh, how to be strong, which now I lift a little bit more than him now. Uh, but most importantly, how to be humble and how to be there for one another. Like you've always been there for me. So, Junior, thank you for being the greatest brother that I could ever ask for. Um, Courtney, I have no doubt you will take care of my brother one because. You've already kind of been doing that already. Um, But (laughs) secondly, um, after knowing you for so long, um, you're incredibly wise, smart, beautiful, caring, and I can see the love you have for my brother. So anyway, I I love you both so much. And once again, congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Bautista. For those that call Hawaii home, a flower lay is a symbol of love, is a symbol of things that are fragile and temporal. A flower lay will last a day or two, then it's gone. Our lives are like the lay within the span of eternity. Therefore, live with tender consideration for each other. Continue to love one another and your marriage will last. May the lays you now offer each other be recognized for the love that you have for one another. Do you, Courtney, take Joe Mar to be your husband? Do you promise to walk by his side forever and to love, help, and encourage him in all he does? Do you promise to take time to talk with him, to listen to him, and to care for him? Will you share his laughter and his tears as his partner, lover, and best friend? Do you take him as your lawfully wedded husband for now and forevermore? I do. Do you, Joe Mark, take Courtney to be your wife? Do you promise to walk by her side forever and to love, to help, and encourage her in all she does? Do you promise to take the time to talk, listen to her, to care for her? Will you share her laughter and her tears as her partner, lover, and best friend? Do you take her as your lawfully wedded wife for now and forevermore? I do. By the power vested in me, by the state of Arizona. It's, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> you stop and cry. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Joe Mar, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> For, for the very first time ever, Mr. and Mrs. Jomar Batista. I did it! You know, you go through life, you find some really good friends and some you may call brothers. And I've had the privilege of calling this man right here, my brother, for the majority of my life. I was like, I couldn't, I couldn't thank him enough for always being there for me. And you know, we've been through a lot of happy times together, even a lot of tears. I want to toast to a brother and the love of his life. I am so blessed to have you guys um, a part of my lives. And um, 
you weren't expecting it, but this is the song that I owe you. <laughs> Nothing like the good 